In 2017, Chile experienced the worst wildfire season on record, with large and destructive fires burning more than 600,000 hectares. Fires sustain biodiversity and prevent the dispersal of invasive species. However, Chile's megafires pose a threat to the country's diverse ecosystems, unique biodiversity, communities, infrastructure, and economy. Over the 2017 fire season, 11 lives were lost and thousands of homes were destroyed. Due to the increased frequency and severity of wildfires, proper management and preparation is required. The Corporación Nacional Forestal, or CONAF, manages Chile's national parks, natural monuments, and oversees the monitoring, prevention, and response to wildfires. It is vital to understand the relationship between fire occurrence and climatic conditions in the region so that community members and environmental departments can make more informed management decisions. To monitor, prevent, and respond to wildfires, CONAF uses NASA Earth observations along with the Global Forecast System to generate wind, relative humidity, and temperature data sets within Google Earth Engine. These data sets are then imported into ArcGIS Photo Builder to determine the probability of fire occurrence and the generation of a red flag warning which means conditions are ideal for increased fire risk. This current workflow can take up to three months to prepare all data sets utilized for fire risk occurrence and recovery and monitoring. To aid the monitoring of wildfires, the NASA developed team at the Jet Propulsion Lab has partnered with Kona to automate the current wildfire detection system. Kona's workflow relies on some manual efforts and they need to say as faster than they are producing them. The developed team used Earth observations such as Landsat 8 OLLI, NASA SRTM, along with the Global Forecast System model, and create fire risk, fire severity, and burned area maps. The key to automating CONAS RGIS workflow was identifying the geoprocessing tools their model relied on, like in burst systems weighted and reclassification, encoding those tools in the JavaScript Google Earth Engine API. Using a combination of Earth observation data and in situ data, the team was able to map wildfire risk and fire perimeters in near real time to improve wildfire prevention and respond time efforts. Results from this project will help identify vulnerable locations of potential wildfire prone areas where partner groups can conduct targeted field campaigns to gather additional validation data. The project results could increase fire resiliency in other countries outside of Chile that also face wildfire issues.